So now the special song I promised everybody on Facebook in honor of the day. One of Eben's great uh, and, and charming works. My bass player, Wolf Clouchy, assures me that this place actually existed once. There's a place in this town where I can be found when there ain't any room at the pub. It's the place I love best when I'm sad or depressed and I'm craving some far eastern grub. It's got fresh cabbage leaf and spicy corned beef and veggies familiar and odd. And though it's owned by a hun, he's loved by it. When he cooks, we can't help but applaud. He's a good Irish man from a faraway land. And how he got his name, I've no clue. But his food is the best from the east to the west at O'Brien's Mongolian Barbecue. My friends all arrive at a quarter to five. If I'm late, they'll save me a seat. Then we take up our bowls and we pile them up full of noodles and veggies and meat. Then O'Brien, he stands with his two magic wands at his circular griddle and chants. We don't know what he does, but we don't care because the result makes us get up and dance. He's a good Irish man from a faraway land And how he got his name I've no clue But his food is the best from the east to the west At O'Brien's Mongolian Barbecue So come to O'Brien's, you'll see I'm not lying It's the strangest place you've ever seen for it's shaped like a yurt, and the floor is bare dirt, and it's all decorated in green. But the best part of all, you can get alcohol. The kumis flows potent and clear. It'll get you so pissed, you won't know what you've missed. But for Patty's sake, don't drink the beer! He's a good Irish man from a faraway land. And how he got his name, I've no clue. But his food is the best from the east to the west at O'Brien's Mongolian Barbecue. He's a good Irish man from a faraway land. His stuff's better than Mum's Irish stew. So we'll drink to his fortune as he serves us our portion of O'Brien's Mongolian Barbecue. The story is that after a couple times of going there, uh, Wolf and, and, and his then wife walk in and there's this big sunburned redhead at the counter and they say, and they say oh, that must be O'Brien. And the guy at the counter says, no, 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 he's O'Brien, pointing to the Mongolian cooking behind him. <laughs> and they never did find out what the story was. They never did find out. Well, the thing is, it used to be O'Brien's fish and chips. <laughs> there was an O'Brien's Fish and Chips in that same spot, and then suddenly, one day when they went, it was O'Brien's Mongolian Barbecue. <laughs>